This video is presented by Team Gaia for Solar Decathlon India. The global climate change scenario is alarming. Since pre-industrial times, the concentration of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere has increased by more than 40%. This carbon dioxide buildup has resulted in rising temperatures, melting glaciers and rising sea levels. This means that we must dramatically cut greenhouse gas emissions. And one method to do so is through net zero energy buildings. Net zero energy buildings generate the same amount of energy as they use. To attain this, they employ a combination of energy efficient technology and renewable energy sources. Furthermore, because they use less energy and are more sustainable, net zero energy buildings have been shown to provide significant long term cost savings. So, how do we achieve a net zero building? Well, for one, Renewable sources of energy that can be installed on site such as bifacial solar PV on the rooftop and solar farm and biogas generation. Bifacial solar PV panels with sun trackers increase energy production by up to 30% while biogas generation provides an efficient way to generate electricity from waste. Moreover, daylighting can be used to reduce lighting costs and improve indoor environment for the occupants. Primarily, these solutions can significantly reduce energy costs for the occupants as they would not have to pay for external electricity. Secondly, it can reduce the carbon footprint of the building, thus contributing to the fight against climate change. Thirdly, it can create a healthy and comfortable indoor environment for the occupants, which can lead to increased productivity and well-being. Radiant cooling is a cooling system that uses radiant energy to cool the indoor space. It entails the installation of pipes or panels that circulate cold water to chill the surfaces around them, such as walls, ceilings and floors. This method of cooling the indoor air eliminates the need for energy-intensive air conditioning equipment. One of the primary advantages of radiant cooling is that it creates a more equal temperature distribution and enhances thermal comfort and indoor air quality for the occupants. Rainwater harvesting can reduce the demand for municipal water supplies, thus conserving water resources and reducing the impact of stormwater runoff on the environment. Additionally, efficient plumbing fixtures, harvesting and using rainwater can reduce the cost of water bills, which can contribute to the economic sustainability of the building as well as reducing the moisture in the building, therefore preventing mold. We're still trying to mitigate and reverse our effect on this planet. Net zero energy buildings are a big step forward for humanity's future towards sustainability and resilience. In addition to the environmental benefits, net zero energy buildings also have significant social and economic advantages. The widespread use of net zero energy buildings can help promote a more sustainable and equitable future for everybody. It has the potential to generate employment in the renewable energy and sustainable construction industries as well as stimulate innovation in building technology and practices. As we move towards a more sustainable future, net zero energy buildings are an important piece of the puzzle and widespread adoption of these building methods are key for creating a better environment for the future generations.